Hawthorne High School students held their first winter show, When Geometry Meets Fashion, at the Sentinella Valley Center for the Arts. We highlighted some of the work that we already did, recycled one, upcycled one, and then we've started to elevate um, more things about not just their design, but about the sustainability of fashion. This geometry class isn't just textbook based. Students learn the effects of fashion on nature, women, labor, and poor people from other countries, as well as put their knowledge into practice. I just really had to measure and like cut it precisely because if I didn't cut it precisely then it would it would look off and the denim and it had Chin like Chinese type fabric on it to tell like different emotions going around but in mathematical ways of a trapezoid, a rectangle. When you try to teach them materials or scenes that are very relevant and real to them, then they get excited. It's so much fun because you get to work with math and designing at the same time, so it's never like just one thing over and over and over. In addition to designing, they get to learn life skills and confidence. For three Saturdays, um, she trained the kids how to walk, and you, if only I was able to document when they were still like learning three Saturdays ago how to walk. The little children are very clingy to their parents, and then now they're walking, and they don't they carry whatever outfit we give them. Like I really would never like go out there and like walk in front of people. I'm really shy, so I feel like this is really a great way to like come out and show how you are and like your personality. What really like made me want to do it was like like after a while I started feeling proud. Tingay Tadena says her dream is to continue to grow the program and fill the auditorium. For HCTV, I'm Jennifer Murillo.